Meghan Harry's popularity right now standing where? What is the ratio? Because remember in the past when they gave the Oprah Winfrey interview, the rating, it was not too, too bad. Yes, surprisingly, it was not too, too bad. They were still sitting at somewhere 60% approval rating or 55%, for example, for Meghan Markle. But now what is the rating? Why they are now losing all this popularity? We know that. But what is exactly happening with people? What they are thinking about Meghan and Harry? And this is something that we want to discuss in this video. And I will tell you the exact rating right now. Before we do that, most of my viewers are not subscribed to this channel. If you are one of them, consider to subscribe. Now, let's talk about the approval rating for Meghan Harry. YouGov, they have reported in the year 2019 that Meghan and Harry, both of them, up after the Oprah Winfrey interview, both of them were having positive ratings, means they did not go into the negatives. However, in 2020, they started to climb down quite a bit. And that time, the, the approval rating was around somewhere around 50 for both of them. But we have reported, and I have said this in my other videos, that in 2021, the approval rating was going further below. Every time they see the approval rating going down, for some reason, they know it and they care about it and they do something. They come out in public, they do an interview or they do another whining in order to improve the rating. So today's video, I'll be sharing with you this exact uh, details uh, from this article that has explained everything so that we have a clear picture where they stand for both Meghan and Harry in terms of popularity and you'll be shocked you'll be shocked I think some of you will not be as shocked but this is shocking given the fact that they have tried so much they have even let go of their own PR because the PR wasn't doing good they took over their own PR they took over their own actual production website Megan Harry they're doing everything now on their own despite all of these efforts despite all of this downsizing cutting laying people off this is where they stand let's take a look at this article then I will explain to you a little bit more almost half of Britain say that Harry Meghan should be stripped of their royal titles and amid backlash over a couple's Netflix documentary okay so what is the rating the Duke and Duchess of Sussex should be stripped of their titles while Harry should be excluded from the line of succession in the aftermath of the Netflix documentary. A poll for the Mail on Sunday has concluded. The survey found that 44% of people think that they should lose their titles while only 19% can't disagree. Okay, a similar proportion of 42% think Harry should be excluded from the line of succession with 23% uh, disagreeing. Okay, so so the survey found that 44% people, now this is very, very important, okay? They think that they should lose their title. And 19% said, no, we don't agree with that, don't quite agree with that. But 42%, so only 2% below of that, they think that Harry should not be part of the royal family's succession anymore. So this shows the gravity of the situation, how people are desperate about this, because only, only like less than 2% compared to the 44% said that Harry should not have anything to do with the British uh, monarchy, and only 23% they said we cannot uh, or we disagree. Now, this is a huge uh, a problem because once the succession is gone now, the title and the succession both are different, okay? Um, you may know all of this but let me tell you this if they are um, losing their titles then there is always going to be a possibility that perhaps uh, they might get it back okay they might get it might get it back because uh, of their good behavior the king might even decide to forgive them take them back give them back the title however if they lose their su succession if they are losing any connection any ties with the british monarchy that would not only mean that the title is gone, that will of course be the case, but also there will be no possibility for them literally to come back to the British family uh, fold. The reason for that is number two. Number one is because 
the royal family they now feel that the damage has been caused by Meghan Harry is something unrepairable and number two is you have to consider who is coming next to the throne and that is Prince William Prince William right now as we have seen and read from the website and different multiple sources he is filming he is filming he's livid he's very very angry he's more angry than Prince uh, sorry King Charles or anybody else for that matter the simple reason for that is because we know he had personal experience with Megan with his own staffer how she treated his staffer at the same time Prince William from the very beginning of this relationship he saw Meghan Markle was a narcissist and he did not miss that point whatsoever he knew that this girl is going to ruin Harry's life he did not know that this girl will actually accuse the entire monarchy of racism but he knew that this girl is a racist and that she will take advantage of Harry this is exactly happened so there are two reasons again number one the whole family they believe now according to multiple sources that the damage is unrepairable and number two Prince William he is going to make it absolutely sure that what he said in the past about Meghan Markle is what he will follow through after all of these nasty nasty comments about the British monarchy the approval rating is very very important for Meghan Harry especially for the fan base because they always quote that look we are doing absolutely great they actually post a lot of pictures and videos on website on online showing us how lovey-dovey these couples are and I have shared those pictures with you like just like this one where you can see that this couple they're having some good time when in reality when in reality they are actually just faking it they are two narcissists they ganged up together and they have one goal and one goal in mind and that is to destroy their own family members nobody else but their own family members obviously doing so we have seen them Meghan and Harry how they have destroyed other people's life they have let go they fired they abused this bullied other staffers and I have reported on this one how they fired or let go the actual uh, website's main uh, person uh, Diana or Diana I think her name and she was fired without really any reason without any replacement for her before she was let go the point here is that these two couple they are narcissists completely mad and they are now obviously ripping the the you know <laughs> the, the, the all the fruits by looking at the numbers that yes it reflects their behavior they are now tanking the popularity is going down we do not know what will happen in the future but definitely that is this is not looking something good for the Meghan Harry fan base thank you guys for joining in see you in the next video